Hi, I'm Tom Zeller from the New York Times and welcome back to Home Green Home and our new old house. We had an energy audit done a few weeks ago. Now we've got the official report. It's full of thermal images that show that we're losing a lot of energy and money. Those blue areas show cold outdoor air coming right through our walls. To stop that energy loss, our auditors suggested a range of improvements, from caulking up gaps where air leaks in, a process called air sealing, to putting new insulation in our walls. We're looking at air sealing. What do they got here? But we can't afford to do everything. So we invited the Green Tree guys, Frank and John, to come back and go over the report to help us decide what to tackle first. Come on in, let's, uh, let's talk this over. We started with the most expensive improvement on the list, wall insulation. So you might remember this was like the, the chilly room we had here. I noticed that you guys uh, suggest wall insulation. Uh, the, the whole house, I guess, doesn't have insulation? In Correct. The After we did the thermography, we yeah. noticed that the house didn't have uh, any insulation, which is typical for a house about this age. Yeah. But if we're on a budget, that's certainly one of the areas that we can actually omit from this project and consider it in the future. Yeah. Uh, it's one of the more expensive items. Yeah, I see. It's a, you're saying it would be roughly 6000 5700 to, do, right. to put insulation in the house, is that, is that the typical amount for... Well, it is. It's, it's actually a laborious process where we're going to take uh, the exterior shingles off and filling in the, the blown cellulose to dense pack it to actually recreate the insulation that wasn't there when they built it. Mm -hmm. So it's a very laborious process. And it's, it's certainly one that will create more comfort and efficiency. But if we're looking at priority areas, you know, the attic and the basement are, are our top priorities. Mm -hmm. Up in the attic, Frank and John are recommending that we remove the old insulation, seal up the gaps, and blow in some new insulation. We're thinking, you know, in order to save a little money, that maybe we would just do the air sealing in the house and save the insulation for, for later. Right. Does that sound like something we'd, we'd want to do? Tom, it's a good start, but I tell you what, once we're up in your attic, and the reason I would suggest that we do the insulation, because you have about two inches of this old insulation here that we like to remove to air seal. If you remember when we took the infrared camera and we took pictures of it, you could actually see the glow of the heat coming through your attic. Right. So for us to remove this now, air seal properly, and then blow a nice coat of um, about 10 inches of cellulose, it's gonna make a tremendous value in your house. Green Tree says for an attic of our size, this would cost about $2,300. Our next stop was down in the basement, where Frank and John suggested some new insulation around our heating ducts. This is certainly a do-it-yourself weekend project. All of the material that you need is available in a home store, and it can be done in a matter of, uh, of, of a half a day, and you certainly can improve the efficiency without having a professional add the cost to it. But what they want us to do most is seal up the drafty leaks and gaps. One look at this thermal image in a corner of our basement shows that cold air, which appears blue, is slipping in where the house frame meets the foundation an area called the rim joist. Often that's where air will infiltrate into the home and start heading up into uh, the living space. Okay, and you're, you're saying you would seal the entire area where the, the joist meets the, the foundation? Correct, in, in this case we'll actually seal the penetration where this pipe is, is uh, uh, penetrating to the exterior as well as foaming the entire area to stop that air from infiltrating into the house. They'll take care of all of our air gaps for about $1,100. You know, if we if we decide to do just the basic stuff, which I think that's what we want to do, right? Yeah. You know, air sealing of the house and and maybe insulating the attic, getting the old stuff out and insulating the attic. What kind of payback time are we talking about? Typically, you'll see in a house like this, I, I, with what it's going to cost, you're probably looking around at five-year payback, five to six-year payback. In terms of energy savings? Correct. We're, we'll get that money back. Correct. Right? And then after that, you're getting savings all throughout. Okay. So you put the money in your... In, in pocket from there on in. Okay, well, uh, we'll look it over and, and think about it. And, and your uh, comfort's going to skyrocket. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> That's, <laughs> absolutely. Absolutely. So we'll uh, we'll go over this again and uh, we'll give you guys a shout. Great. So, great. Thanks, Tom. Thanks, nice to see you again. Thank you. Take care. Nice seeing you.